hello guys you're welcome to my youtube channel today i'm going to be showing you how to debug this problem saying dre not found how do you go about it and what causes this error message i'm going to be closing this window quickly and show you how i got to that i've got a pipeline and in the pipeline i want to move data from my on-prem environment into cloud on my data lake and I've created my integration runtime using self-hosted integration runtime. And because of that, I'm getting this error. And if I should debug this again, everything seems fine. The source is fine. The sync is fine. But I keep getting this error telling me that GRE is not found. What leads to this error and what causes that? Just allow this to, to run quickly. You can see I've gotten that error again. And what causes this error about GRE? Luckily, there's a Microsoft documentation that tries to solve this problem. I'm going to drop the link to this in the description and you can see that packet format is the problem. So I'm trying to move my file from um, SQL database into my data lake and I want to store it in a packet format. And this is the folder I want to store my data. And I'm having that problem because there is a conflict in the packet format, moving that and changing it. I need to have GRE, that is Java, installed in my machine to be able to do that. If you read this, they said, for copy empowered by self-hosted integration runtime, e.g. between on-premise and cloud data store, you are not copying packet file as is. You need to install 64-bit GRE, that is Java runtime environment, or open JDK. So I'm going to be using the Java runtime environment. And to do that, I can just click on this link. Let me open in a new window. Click on this. I'm going to be downloading Windows offline 64 bit. That is done downloading. I'm just going to be double clicking on this to have it installed within my environment. Install. And when this is completed, I can go back to my ADF and run my pipeline again, and this should be fine. This is completed, so I'm going to close this. Let's go back to our ADF. This is my pipeline copy data. I'm getting the data from my SQL database into my data leak. And with that of the way, I'm just going to be debugging again. Just to show you that I don't have the folder here. There's no folder created yet. And when I run this and it's successful, I should have that folder created. Let's see what happens. It succeeded. And what it means is that I should have my folder within my data lake. So let me refresh this. I go to tutorials and it shows me that my new folder has been created. And this is the data that I copied from my SQL database to Azure. You could, you could just do that and follow this same um, explanation and have that installed um, the GRE within your environment and you should be fine. Thank you. See you in my next video.